There are many different types of pumps. Here, we will help you understand the differences between each pump type. We can generally categorize pumps into two major types, which work in very different ways and these two types encapsulate most pumps. Dynamic pumps. Positive displacement pumps. Dynamic pumps with their more well-known subcategory centrifugal pumps are the most commonly used worldwide. These pumps are designed to move fluid by transfer of rotational energy from the rotor, also called an impeller, to the fluid. The fluid is sucked into the rotating impeller along its axis and is moved out by centrifugal force along through the impeller. The action of the impeller increases the fluid's velocity and pressure and also directs it towards the pump outlet. These these pumps are widely used, efficient, and fairly cheap to make. These pumps are great for applications with higher flows and lower viscosity liquids, and are not suitable for when you need to pump in high viscosity fluids. We can classify impellers into three designs. Axial flow. The axial flow impeller discharges fluid along the shaft axis. Radial flow. The radial flow impeller discharges the fluid radially at 90 degrees to the shaft axis. Mixed flow. The mixed flow impeller discharges fluid in a conical direction using a combined radial and axial pumping action. Positive displacement pumps. A positive displacement pump moves a fluid by mechanisms like pistons, screws, gears, rollers, diaphragms, or vanes. These pumps cyclically close a fixed volume and move it mechanically through the system. This kind of pump is categorized based on the mechanism used to pump the fluid, and it can have a variety of applications based on its mechanism. Due to the design, positive displacement pumps are better at handling viscous materials. There are many different types of positive displacement pumps such as rotary lobe pump. It uses two or more lobes rotating around parallel shafts in the pump's body to move liquids. Progressing cavity pump. It transfers fluid through a process, through the pump of a sequence of small, fixed-shaped, discrete cavities as its rotor is turned. Rotary gear pump. It employs a rotor and idler gear assembly to generate its flow. Piston pump, which uses reciprocating pistons to move the fluid. Diaphragm pump that uses a combination of reciprocating action of a diaphragm and valves on either side of the diaphragm to pump a fluid. Screw pump that uses one or several screws to move the fluid across its screw axis. Gear pump that uses gears to pump fluid by displacement. Vein pump consists of veins mounted to a rotor that rotates inside a cavity and moves the fluid. Peristaltic pump consisting of a single piece of hose which is compressed via rollers or shoes, moving fluid from the inlet to the outlet of the pump. 